In this video, I will show you how to send back data on a ASP.NET uh, MVC core uh, application without a bound database uh, data model. Um, in here, we have a ASP form, uh, ASP.NET core, blah, 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 MVC form. But um, what you see there, it's, uh, it's not, no data are bound. It's, uh, that's a text control and that's a diff control with uh, content edible to true. And for this demonstration, I, I didn't bind uh, some stuff. So it's simple without anything, you know. And how, how will I gi give back this, uh, the data? Uh, I have here this text control and in text control, uh, I cannot send back the diff control. All that I do can do is the text send back the text control. And I have inside there the view data, view data. Uh, but I, when the stuff is sent back, I want to get the result from there, nothing else. And so I decided uh, to take on my postback event here. That's the postback event to to say uh, that's my postback. And inside there, I have the parameters. Uh, I form collection form fields. So as soon as the uh, as you, I send back the form, the result comes in there and fills in the forms uh, from the HTTP context, which is coming in. So when we do this, uh, okay, first I say here, uh, um, this is, this is text one. Uh, I copy all that stuff at runtime to my text area and now I send it. And as soon as I send it, the, uh, the server gets the response on HTTP post and that's the post uh, method. And the fields are automatically filled in there. So if we watch the fields, we will see that uh, there's the text which I have written in there. This is not the text one. Uh, let's see. There are, <coughs> there are two fields in there. Text one, that's the one. Uh, and now this is text one. This is text one. That's what I've written. And now we go on and so we get F10 from form fields, text one, we get the result, this is text one. And then the stuff goes out again. Now, uh, the most important stuff is when I'm, for example, in Word also and have a Word document written and I take out uh, HTML stuff from there and I drop it in there then you will see that gets a big block on there and now when I send it I get the HTML uh, on my postback that's the real uh, positive effect on all that stuff